Hi everybody, it's Amy from Bargain Beauty. So we are gonna talk about a little different topic today. And today we're gonna to talk about couponing and food stamps. So for the purpose of this video, we are going to assume that anybody receiving food stamp or SNAP benefits is 100% legitimately receiving them because they need them. So we're not gonna judge anyone. We're not gonna say whether or not we should have that program or shouldn't have the program. The program is in place and a lot of states have now decided that you have to work a minimum of 20 hours per week in order to receive food stamp benefits. If you, it, every state is different. Some states, if you are not at least volunteering, um, you cannot receive the benefits if you are not working part time, if you do not have children, they cap off how much you can receive. So we're not going to get into all of that because that's political. What we want to talk about today is that we, we should really be using coupons if we have SNAP benefits. Now, I personally at this time do not have SNAP benefits. Um, I am disabled, but I do receive enough income between my income and my child support that I am over the limit to receive them. So, have I ever received them in the past? Yes, I have. When I was in between closing my salon and getting my disability, I 100% utilized food stamps. Now, I no longer need to at this point. Will I ever get in my life? I don't know. So my thing is to not to frown down on people. It is to help them to maximize using them to the fullest of their ability. So especially people don't understand that you, maybe you can use coupons with SNAP benefits and you want to use them if possible. I think there's a huge misconception that more people abuse them than actually do, but that's again, political. A lot of our military families are, are using SNAP benefits because they need to. They're serving our country. They have families. Then families need to be fed living here in the United States and they're overseas. So lots of good benefits that come along with this program, not just negative ones. So you should absolutely be using coupons. So if you have $100, you can maybe multiply that times two or three. So if you're receiving $100 in benefits, and let's say you need cereal for the month, like $100, obviously, and you have a family of, let's just say, a mom and two children, okay? So if you have a mom and two children, and you have four weeks to feed your family on $100, you need to use coupons in order to be able to stretch your food out for the month. So you could get three boxes of cereal instead of one for the same exact price if you're using coupons. Coupons are an amazing thing, amazing thing to help people in need. So it's just like another form of money. Coupons is absolutely, when you see that number, you know, a dollar, three dollars, five dollars, to me, I treat that as currency. It is cash. It is money. It is money that you're not spending out of pocket. The stores get reimbursed the value of the coupon plus eight cents for handling. So they get reimbursed by the manufacturing companies 100% plus eight, eight cents shipping. So, or handling, they call it handling and shipping or processing. So it's absolutely worth it for you guys if you are on SNAP benefits to be using coupons. <coughs> oh, excuse me. And if you are a couponer and know somebody who receives benefits, maybe you could help them learn. Maybe you could teach them how to use coupons, give them a couple of coupons to start with. They might be overwhelmed because they're already in a very, you know, bad situation financially. So they may think, oh my God, coupons on top of everything else. I don't think I can do it. Well, sometimes we need to lend a helping hand and sometimes that's just educating. It's not necessarily handing somebody something. You don't have to go in your cupboard and hand them five cans of soup if you can't afford to do that. But what you can do is reach out in your community and help people learn how to use coupons so they can maximize their money. So I just want to come on here real quick and just say, you know, I 100% think that if you are on SNAP benefits or what they call food stamps, you should be using coupons. I think it would be a wonderful thing to stretch out your money for the month and provide quality food for your family. So thank you guys so much for watching. I just want to have an open discussion in the comment section about this. Please, no negativity. We are not looking down upon anyone. We are not judging people, and you can't hold everyone accountable for a few people that might be abusing the system. So thank you guys so much for watching. Give a big thumbs up if you like this video. Comment down below if you have helped someone learn how to coupon, if you feel that, you know, SNAP benefits, you know, it'd be a great thing for them to use coupons, and how do we get those resources to people who need it? So have a good day. Bye-bye.